it guys we're back for another dokkan battle video so we had gotten the new dragon ball story event um you know the start of the conflict on the planet namek saga um as is usual right you do uh, a bunch of missions um you know during one of these dragon ball stories you know using certain characters um in each stage and then we're able to unlock a new support memory here um, this one right here. This is Krillin's Miraculous Power-Up. So let's go and take a look at what Krillin's Miraculous Power-Up does. Um, I don't know how much I like this one. So, again, this is Krillin's Miraculous Power-Up. Rapid Growth category allies get 10% attack and defense for two turns at the start of the fight. And then you get three key in addition to Planet Namek Saga category allies. Now, the main issue I've got with this, if we just quickly pull up Planet Namek Saga right here, I think that the key is going to be pretty nice. But the characters that can make use out of this, it's basically just Krillin and Gohan. Well, guess what? Krillin and Gohan don't really have crazy units in Planet Namek Saga, right? All we have is the LR. So it's like we're, we're sort of our focus for this video um, is going to be this LR right here, this LR Krillin and Kid Gohan. Um, this is a unit that, while I think they are fairly powerful and can be fairly powerful, I just think that their wonkiness really is a bit of a detriment to them. Um, but I guess, I mean, we could hop in and we, we could see how powerful this unit might look. They're going to get the extra key, which is good from the support memory, although they already get one key per key for obtain, which is really good. We'll also get the buff. I think we'll probably head into Rapid Growth Category Super Bottle Road, um, and we'll utilize this, right? I, the thing about some of these support memories, I guess I do have to think about this in this way, right? This is very easy to get. It, it is super easy to go into that Dragon Ball Story event. You can get it, the support memory in 20 minutes or something like that. If you're like a new player or someone who, you know, has struggled in some of the difficult content or something like that, being able to get this Krillin's Miraculous Power-Up, this would be good for the Rapid Growth Super Battle Road stage. Like, if you're going to beat it for the first time, this is a great one to pick because most of these fights are probably not going to go too far, you know, past turn three, four, or five, right? So it's like you're going to get a nice buff for most of the fight there. So, I do feel like this could be useful for that, but I don't know. I, this is not really a very imaginative effect, I would say. Just this buff for two turns. Not really too crazy. So, um, I guess let's just go ahead and hop into a Super Battle Road stage. We'll go to the Rapid Growth stage, and uh, we'll see if we see any effects by popping this uh, support memory right here. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and hop in like this, um, and let's see what we are able to do. Um, we'll go ahead and see the actual support memory in action. Uh, remember that the big unit we're really taking a look at here, oh, good, they're on first rotation, um, is the Krillin and Gohan, right? Like, they're kind of the unit that we're, kind, I guess, sort of highlighting the most here, because they're the ones that are getting the full buff from it. You know, that the basically active skill, 10% attack and defense, um, but the additional three key, I mean, the three key could be pretty good for Krillin and Gohan, considering that they do get um, the additional with a high chance to be a super at 24 key, right? So, I mean, it certainly does make sense that the Krillin support memory would be good for the Krillin unit. Um, this is actually not bad. Yeah, I, I think we're we're actually kind of cooking right here. Just hopefully Master Mutaido doesn't just one-shot us. Are you kidding me? 23 key? No! What? No, dude. 23 key. Nice. Alright. Um, and that's with the 3 key buff. I don't know. Th this actually could be bad. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here's the showcase. And we're just gonna... Okay, that's good. That's good. Thank, thank God. Thank God for our GOAT, Tech Ultimate Gohan. 95k? That's it? Well, I guess I... I you know, all these characters are getting buffed. Jeez. Dude... Super Battle Road is this easy? Oh my god, it's nothing compared to... The first stage of Red Zone stages is harder than this. It's... I have to listen to people cry, All these stages matter! Dude, the first round of Red Zone is harder than this. What the hell? Come on. Alright, Sirius Krillin and Gohan. I do not get to use this unit very often, man. 
Um, almost never do I use him. Wow, double digits. Wow, okay. Dude, this stage is piss easy. Are you kidding me? What? Double digits? What is this? All right, we're definitely using an item here. Um, let's use a Ghost Usher right here. Uh, Master Potato is definitely hanging in there. Um, so let me do this right here. Um, and then I'll do this. Perfect. Okay. So we have those tech orbs for tech Gohan. And then with Krillin and Gohan, we can get all those AGL orbs right there. Um, so yeah, again, I, I don't really know that you're going to be using this support memory, um, in a lot of different scenarios or situations or anything like that, right? Um, I think the one time you would definitely make use out of this, uh, would be this stage right here. Um, I mean, th this, some of these Super Battle Road stages can definitely be tougher than others. This stage, I think, could actually be rather annoying just because of the unnecessarily and very stupid limited nature of the Rapid Growth Category team, which, I mean, everyone knows is a, is a pure joke, um, and that this team should be way better. I'm actually going to be able to pop this. Wow, okay. I guess it is just turn three for them to be able to, to use their active skill, right? Well, this will get us 24 key. Sure, let's go ahead and play this. Okay, so there's that. Um, I guess the one good thing about their active skill, too, is that we can use it after they transform, too, right? Um, so we should be looking pretty good here. Now, I guess that, that active skill is very helpful because now it'll easy allow, easily allow us to get Super Vegeta, um, a super attack. Not really too sure what I'm going to do with rotations or anything like that. Again, just kind of figuring out a place to use this support memory, and this is, you know, kind of what I came up with, right? Like, if we're going to use the rapid growth buffing support memory, I think the rapid growth, like, locked stage will be the perfect one to do. Of course they didn't. Man, come on. Krillin and Gohan, y'all could have double super for me right there. Not really getting the greatest luck. Uh, and then remember that STR Super Vegeta... I mean, he, dude, the aging hit him overnight, right, with red zone and 200% leader skills. Um, but Super Vegeta can be a very powerful character, I think, still in, like, Battlefield and Super Battle Road. Um, especially, like, because if you can stun uh, any, you know, any stage where you could stun, that Super Vegeta is going to be very powerful. Um, a stage where you're able to get that guaranteed stun off that Super Vegeta does. That's why Super Vegeta, you know, he could have been better, but... With, with the 100% chance to stun and 100% chance to crit, like, that is very valuable. So, you'll, you'll be able to find spots um, to use that Super Vegeta in probably for quite a while. I'm gonna just uh, use another Ghost Usher, I guess, right here. Sure, sure, sure. Um, And I guess we'll go for Crane Hermit here. Because um, I guess if we, if we could take down Crane Hermit... Um which we potentially could, then things will be easier. I don't know, man. This is... They... This is a support memory. I'm not really the biggest fan of the, the effect that they did. For the most part, I feel like a lot of these support memories have had sort of, like, interesting or, or different kind of effects. This one, not really so much, right? Is the effect, like, that good? Um... It, 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 it's, again, pretty much just going to be limited to this one stage. It's just, like, almost like the Corona Body and Mind one as well, right? Like, when we got that Vegeta's Pride support memory, like, that's pretty much you're just going to use that for, like, the Corona Body and Mind Super Battle Road stage whenever that happens or some type of similar thing, right? All right. Um, let's see how we do with Krillin and Gohan. We are going to be able to get 24 key right here. Perfect. We didn't even need the extra three key from the support memory either. Looks like we would have been completely good to go even without that extra key right there. But yeah, th this is pretty much how this is going to look. Um, because this is a stage where Attack Ultimate Gohan can sort of spread his wings and be very dominant in slot one, right? Um, and kind of just with good luck with key orbs, we can let the other characters on the team sort of, um, you know, be very powerful, right? Krillin and Gohan, uh, Tech Hit. STR Super Vegeta, you know, these characters can sort of get us the dub. Rapid growth, I mean, you guys know, oh, this is, we should be okay. They can tank this, right? 
Oh, wow. Uh, so remember that they're 10. Jeez, that's no items. That's just they just ate that. Um, I think that this stage might just be very easy. Is that a... Like, like, we definitely got buffed by the support memory right there. They did double super. I mean, keep in mind that they get 50% uh, defense on their 18 key, and they get 30% defense on their 12 key. So, like, we were able to take advantage of both of those on that turn right there. Um, but, yeah, outside of the stage, I, I probably don't see myself using this support memory um, basically ever, right? Like, outside of the stage. No! Are you kidding me? <laughs> The, the, the whole purpose of this is for the damn support memory, and the, the cord kicks in. Well, whatever. We saw it multiple times. Uh, I guess I'm just going to... There's th This rotation, I don't really care about too much. Um, let's get rid of Grandpa Gohan right here. Um, I, I think if we can just get rid of our boy Grandpa Gohan. Hmm. I guess if I do this right here... Then this would be a super attack for Super Vegeta. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, I just want to get rid of Grandpa Gohan, and then um, I think we could probably have Krillin and Gohan do massive damage to a knee next turn. Because I think when I, I remember when I was doing this uh, no item Super Battle Road run right here that uh, Grandpa Gohan, I think, has far less HP than a knee, right? Um, so, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this support memory. If you guys have any ideas for, I guess, what could be like a better support memory or anything like that. I mean,. This one is certainly a support memory, I guess. I don't know, man. What do you want me to say? They, I, the ones I love are the permanent buffing ones. Those are the crazy support memories, right? I actually, you know, right now it's a Tanabata celebration. I actually have them pretty disappointed because it's like when they build up one of these teams. Right now, Future Saga is sort of the team that they built up. I really wish that we had some sort of support memory. Um, that would be a permanent buff to those categories, right? We just got the Goku family one. Vegeta family's getting one after, um... Uh, I guess we could do this. We should still be able to get enough key for Krillin and Gohan. We'll be able to get that right there. That, wow. Again, we went up to 23 key with them. That is very unfortunate. Because remember, at 24 key, literally one more key... They get the guaranteed additional. That's a 50% chance of being a super attack. So uh, that is an extreme bummer that twice we are one key shy of that. Because, again, uh, essentially what we're doing here is showcasing Krillin and Gohan. Since they're the only character on the team that's able to take full advantage of the support memory. 192 right there. But I believe this Anin is quite a bit more powerful than the previous enemies in these Super Battle Rotages. That's why I bring that Super Trunks right there exactly, is that stun that he can do. Um, okay, I guess we'll just use a Princess Snake here. Uh, that might not be enough. We can also pop a Nurse GG. <laughs> whatever, man. And whatever, we won, we won, we won, we won. We'll, we'll just uh, wrap up our W, and then we'll call it a day. So yeah, let me know if uh, some interesting support memory effects you guys... Uh, might be interested in seeing i definitely do enjoy at the very least having the animations um added in game for a lot of these you know notable moments the only thing is i really do wish that they were voice acted and um, i think a lot of these would be a lot more entertaining um if they were actually had uh voice acting right i i still feel like uh, maybe i'm crazy dokkan could literally just Oh, there's a maintenance one night, and then, oh, bam, we added voice lines to all the support memories. Like, that would make those way more entertaining. Because um, there's iconic voice lines in a lot of those. Like, um, what about the, the Planet Namek Saga uh, buffing one? The Warrior Awakened Through Fury, right? Like, that Goku talking shit to Frieza? Like, tell me how raw that would be with the actual, like, you know, dialogue in there. Like, it would be great. Um, I definitely would love to see that, but there we go. Um, there is the Krillin support memory. What is it called again? It's Krillin's miraculous power up. Um, okay. I guess we're just randomly having court issues today too. That's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> All right. We're going to, yeah, perfect for the amazing support memory for Krillin here. Great way to end. <laughs> All right. There we go, man. Uh, let me know what you guys think of uh, the Krillin's Miraculous Power-Up support memory right here. We've now, you know, there's now quite a few in the game for sure. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all next time.